In a game with playoff implications for both squads, Tampa Bay runs smack dab into the hottest goaltender perhaps in NHL history, the Hamburger. Uh, Andrew Hammond for Ottawa with a, a big night for him. He made 28 saves. He's now 16-1-1, and mm -hmm. the Bolts fall in overtime 2-1. Yeah, a desperate Ottawa team where they are uh, looking for points, trying to catch the Boston Bruins, and you could see that they were... They were into this game right at the beginning. The Lightning did bounce back. Uh, it was definitely a goaltender's duel. Uh, Jonathan Druin in the first period tied this game, the rookie. It's his second goal in three games, and David came on the power play. Certainly an encouraging sign for the Lightning. Encouraging sign in two fronts. One, and Jonathan Druin is back on track. He's got two goals in the last three games. Uh, he is playing very, very well, handling puck, good lots of confidence. And the power play. Uh, the power play had struggled in, the, when, in a couple of losses. Uh, now is back, so they need that going into the playoffs. Patrick Wierkosh scored with just 16 seconds to go yeah. in overtime to beat Ben Bishop. I don't think that can discount the uh, effort that he made tonight facing 34 shots. Yeah, Ben Bishop was solid again. The they, Ottawa Senators threw a lot at them, and uh, but Ben Bishop, like he's done all year long, has played very well. Saturday, they conclude the five-game road trip in South Florida against another playoff desperate team. Here is Florida chasing the pack. They're coming off a 6-1 win over Carolina and Roberto Luongo was the number one star in that yeah. game. So quietly, he played very well. What would you anticipate? Well, the uh, Florida Panthers are a team that are desperate just like the Ottawa Senators. They need points. Uh, they were probably going to have to run the table and get some help from somebody to get into the playoffs. But it's going to be a game where uh, there to be very intense, a playoff atmosphere. They got a guy named Yarmer Yager, yeah. too. Pretty good, huh? And uh, Gerard Gallant is the head coach, former Lightning skater, has done a terrific job behind the bench. So 6.30 on Saturday, the road trip concludes for the Tampa Bay Lightning as they take on the Florida Panthers.